Live, the one and only Local 10 News starts right now. And one man avoided a major operation all by getting a second opinion. The story that may have you calling to book an appointment. That's coming up. And you know, most of us really don't hesitate to ask our friends and our family for opinions when it comes to issues in our lives. And it's no less important when it comes to our health. Local 10 Medical Specialist Dr. Ari Sofer says never underestimate the value of that second opinion. And today he shows us how it may have saved one guy's life. David Winters has lived a colorful life. Which means like be a slob, it's not I'm anti-social. 50 years ago, he was a dancing gang member in the big screen version of West Side Story. Today, he's producing and acting his own East Side Story, the latest in a long line of movies. You don't know anything about dancing. Yeah. What do I know about dancing? But the most dramatic line he ever heard was delivered last year by a cardiac surgeon in North Florida. You're late, kid. And that surgeon said to me, you must have a triple bypass and two valves, certainly one, but possibly two, it looks like, replaced. On the advice of friends and following his own instincts, David sought a second opinion from Mount Sinai cardiologist, Dr. Joseph Lamellis. Rather than needing a major operation, Lamellis was able to correct David's problems through a minimally invasive procedure. I see many patients here in the office that are told that what I do for them cannot be done. And it's just quite the opposite. Dr. Lamellis said David actually could have been hurt rather than helped by a major bypass operation, which is why he strongly encourages people to get a second opinion. If they're not comfortable with what the physician tells them, they shouldn't just accept it. I think they need to look for alternatives and look for people who are qualified to be able to do it. You understand that? David Winters is glad he did. Every moment that I'm in the hospital, that I'm with these people, I feel comfortable, I feel reassured. They're brilliant. For me, they're God sent to me. I really, I mean, it's very hard for me to talk about it without crying. I strongly believe patients should educate themselves and always seek out alternative views on medical issues. A well-informed patient will always have the greatest chances of a positive outcome. With your second opinion, I'm Dr. Ari Sofer. And a South Florida-based website called secondopinions.com does offer advice and input from hundreds of specialists for just a small fee. And if you have questions on a health-related issue, you can also email us at askdrsofer at local10.com. Janine, Victor?